Chuck Quinn, and I'm here with Dr. David Albert today, founder of the iPhone EKG. It's a really neat device that you attach to your iPhone, and it monitors and records your heart rate. Dr. David Albert, how does this device work? Well, thank you, Chuck, for having me. Uh, the iPhone ECG is uh, made up of two parts. One is a case that fits on like any iPhone case, slides right onto your iPhone, in this case, an iPhone 4. And the second one is the app that utilizes the data that's wirelessly transmitted from that case as you're holding it either in your hands or on a, yours or your, a patient's chest, and, and takes that, that ECG data, displays, analyzes it, stores it locally, and then streams it securely to our web server where it can be reviewed either retrospectively or in real time using a Java applet on any browser. And so it's really a very powerful tool allowing cardiac rhythm assessment anywhere, anytime, anywhere in the world. That's amazing. How does it work? Well, uh, let me show you, Tuck. Basically, like any iPhone case, it's a very small, lightweight case with a couple of stainless steel electrodes on the back which are used for acquiring the ECG. You snap your iPhone in it, okay? And now we've turned the iPhone into an integrated personal ECG device. And this device can be used with the app, and I'll bring the app up, to show you a patient's electrocardiogram that can be viewed in real time, either at the patient holding it in their hands or you placing it on the chest as if you're using a stethoscope. In fact, we call it an ECG stethoscope. <laughs> And so you can analyze, store, and upload directly to a remote physician, like a cardiologist, for a remote consult in real time. Very cool. So who There's do you think There's a PVC, you're... by the way. So oh, uh, nice. So who do you think your target market is, and well, uh, where do you see people using this device? Well, I think uh, actually it's interesting since this went public and went viral, we've had people all over the world bringing us new application ideas. One of the ones I hadn't thought about was EMTs. Oftentimes they'll show up at a motor vehicle accident site and a victim will be trapped in a car. They can't lift up their life pack device to hook them up. And so they could take this out, put it on their chest, and, and do an immediate rhythm evaluation on that patient before they're able to extract them and put, hook them up to the defibrillator. So that's an application. Home health general practitioners. So you come in as a family medicine doc, you listen to the chest, you listen to the lungs, now you'll be able to assess the rhythm immediately in your atrial fibrillation patients, all your oldsters who go in and out of AFib and you'll know, Mr. Jones, you're back in AFib, we've got to check your INR, we've got to make sure your rate's okay, you're anticoagulated appropriately, etc. So it can be used by physicians. And then finally, it can be used by patients, a consumer-like device where they can collect their own rhythm data and automatically upload that to be reviewed by a service or reviewed by a caregiver, like their family doc or like a CCU nurse who says, oh, Mr. Jones is having runs of VTAC, you know, we need to change his meds, we need to bring him in. So it has many uses by many people along the healthcare chain. That's amazing. Now, when do you think we can get the device in our own hands? Well, we'll have a first version out by the middle of the year, and uh, some of these applications require FDA clearance under the 510K program, and that's going to require a process that I'm very familiar with. I've done it many times, but it's a process that takes months, takes work, clinical, clinical validation studies, uh, other studies validating uh, the device, making sure we've met all the international standards, and we're involved in that right now. So I can tell you, I'm optimistic 2011, the iPhone ECG will be in the hands of caregivers and be in the hands of patients. Great. Thank you so much for talking you're, with us today very and welcome. showing us a live demo. Thank you. I'm Tuck Quinn, and this is Scrubbed In. Thank you, ma'am. Here you can see Dr. David Albert demonstrating the use of the iPhone EKG with his two middle fingers touching the electrodes, and it's picking up his EKG rhythm strip as well as his heart rate. Phone EKG can also be used directly on a patient's chest, even through a t-shirt. However, for the purposes of this demonstration, Dr. Albert has graciously allowed us to use his chest. Now with the lead one access, it's the left arm and the right arm together. You have to position it appropriately on the chest. And here, it's going to pick up his cardiac rhythm. In a second, it will also pick up his pulse, and that is the iPhone EKG.